Welcome. My name is Mrs. Diedrich and I'm one of your assistant principals here at Troy High School. I first want to just welcome you to THS this year. We are excited to have everyone back and we are back to better this year. What I want to do today is just introduce you to the office. Our main office can be accessed through the main doors where you get dropped off for buses or parent drop off. So let's go on in. So in the office, the first person that you might see is our athletic secretary, Mrs. Dolph. So all things athletics, tickets, things like that, you'll come to see her here. Speaking of athletics, our athletic director, Mr. Palmer, can also be found here in the main office. We also are gonna have an attendance secretary. Her name is Mrs. Ingle, so you'll see her as soon as you come in. Especially if you're late or tardy, you'll need to stop here. If you're signing in or out early or late, you'll also need to see Mrs. Ingle. Also in the main office, maybe one of the most important people you'll know here in the office is Mrs. Strawn. Mrs. Strawn will help you with power school, information, tickets, lockers, pretty much anything that's not athletics or attendance, you'll see Mrs. Strawn for that here in the high school office. Okay, let's head on back to the principal's offices. At the back of the hallway is Mr. Dilbone's office. He also oversees all the seniors, but of course, our entire building. Next in the middle you'll find my office. I oversee all the students who are freshmen through juniors with the last names L to Z as well as taking care of all the attendants. And last but not least is Mr. Schultz. He's your other assistant principal and he oversees all the students with the last names A to K for freshmen through juniors. Mr. Schultz is going to show you all of the student services offices as well. Let's go come with me. Okay, at this time, guys, we're going to go in and meet our guidance counselors. We're in student services. There's guidance counselors, our school nurse, our school resource officer, and our school psychologist are all in this area. So follow me in here. All right, we've got four guidance counselors, and they split up the alphabet. So first office, first office when you come in is Mr. Metz. He has last names A through F. Then we come down. This is Mrs. Evil Sizers office she has last names G through O then you have Mr. Gibbons he has the last part of the alphabet P through Z and then down here is Mr. Dilwich he takes care of all the kids that go to the Career Center um, anybody that uh, is, is using either our stadium programs and then the secretary that works this area is Mrs. Schreiber she will be the person you talk to when you come in to see one of these guys let's head down this way and see what's in the other half Okay guys, when you come down to this end of student services, Officer Tilly is here as our school resource officer. You go straight back this way and Mrs. Walker, our school nurse, is back here to help you with any medical situations. And then we have Mrs. Kazmaier's office, she's our school psychologist. Now we're gonna head back down to the other end again, to the main office, where Mr. Palmer is gonna to talk to you about everything athletics, tickets, eligibility, things such as that. Hi freshmen, I'm Mr. Palmer. I am the director of athletics. I'm here to talk to you about three things that are important uh, in regards to your time here at Troy High School. Uh, first of all, if you are a high school athlete and you participate in two sports, you can get your PE credit waived. If you're interested in that, you can talk to your guidance counselor. Second thing I'd like to talk to you about is academic eligibility. Academic eligibility is required for the winter sports and for spring sports and it is based off of your grades that you earn the quarter prior to the season beginning. Uh, you must pass five one credit classes in order to be academically eligible. Third thing is how do you get tickets for games? Uh, most of our tickets are going to be available online this year so you have that option to purchase an electronic ticket using the athletic website. For uh, home varsity football games we will sell pre-sale tickets uh, in the athletic office. Uh, those are five dollars. You can also get a pre-sale ticket for away varsity football games uh, in the athletic office as well. Um, those are available usually on, until Friday of game day at three o'clock. Uh, we will have some sports that will offer paper tickets available at the gate. If you have any questions about any of the above, feel free to stop into the athletic office anytime. 